arrived in the middle of the night. Oh boy, what a sight. This strange place was now their home. As if that wasn't bad enough, they uncovered a guy called Nuff. And now their lives are upside down. Never be the same with him around. Oh, mommy, an Egyptian mommy. Oh, it ain't funny. He's for real. Pharaoh, I've seen Pharaoh. Until he's healed The afterlife is pending an appeal And to keep him under wraps is an ordeal um, For my next task, I would like something that is uniquely suited to my abilities. How unfortunate there are no tasks that require extreme laziness and the capacity to eat fried foods. <laughs> Oh, that is a shame. Yes. Here we are, number 199. <laughs> Be true to yourself. But that is what I am doing right now. <laughs> well, I do not think so. In order to fulfill this task, you must ask yourself, who are you? I, I am not the Prince of Abu Simbel, son of Ramses II. Ah, that is your title. But who is Prince Nuff? Nuff is I. I am Nuff. Nuff is me. <laughs> Task completed. <laughs> I do not care for this taskmaster set. It is making me think too much. <laughs> this task is as cunning as the riddle of the Sphinx. I shall need more cheese to repair. Nuff! Breakfast. Where's Nuff? Do we care? No, I don't. I think you two should be nicer to Nuff. I think I should have a social life that doesn't include explaining ancient undead mummies in the attic. <laughs> What's in the paper? Actually, something interesting. They're uh, shooting a movie at that studio down the street. Really? Mm -hmm. You're kidding. Let me see. All right, sweetheart. I was done reading anyway. It's going to be called... Invaders of the Forgotten Tomb. It tells the story of a long forgotten pharaoh from the 19th dynasty named Nuff. Let me see. It's all about Nuff. Does it say what kind of story it is? Probably the story of a mummy who eats a family out of house and home and drives a ruggedly handsome father crazy. It says it's about the mummy from hell. Sounds the same to me. I don't think Nuff's gonna like this. Good morning, slave family. I will enjoy a large glass of the orange-colored juice with strips of swine fried in its own fat. Oh, enough. We have some bad news. I ain't having no more swine fat. Oh, <laughs> grievous tragedy. No, no, no. We have bacon. But what about those flakes you insist are made from corn? No. It's not about food. Uh, we just found out that they're going to be making a movie about your life. <laughs> the mummy part of your life. <laughs> that is not bad news. <laughs> if Nuff is to be immortalized, then I approve. Uh, are there any documents I should endorse? Uh, Nuff, I don't think they're consulting you on this one. They think you're dead. No technicality. <laughs> I would like to know how I will be portrayed. Back in ancient Egypt, Snefru the scribe wrote a stupendous play about my reign as pharaoh. I thought you were pharaoh for only one day. Yes, it was a short play. Ah. Now the world will see how great and kind a rule enough truly was. Hey, maybe we can download the script off the internet. You know, check it out. Here we go. What do they say about me? I'm guessing they use the word magnificent. <laughs> that is how I would describe myself. <laughs> right. Enter the evil mummy Nuff, the most hated pharaoh in the history of time. Is that the most hated? Oh, him is just the smelly, he was hated. Or his brother Rimesis the smelly, and now he was even more hated. <laughs> but, but that is an exaggeration. Seems like most of Nuff's lines are just grunting sounds. Ah! <laughs> I do not verbalize in this manner. 
When have you heard me use the word arg in a sentence before? Let me see this papyrus filled with lies. <laughs> they seem to think I'm capable of pursuing mortals in a frightening manner. <laughs> this is not how a pharaoh conducts himself while I'm dead. Nuff moves across the temple floor with the grace of a wounded ox. A what? A wounded <laughs> oxen? Oh, this is untrue. I have the legs of a Nubian dancer. <laughs> yes, keep them in my sarcophagus. <laughs> oh, back in ancient Egypt, I was known as Nimble Prince Nuff. <laughs> At the harvest festival, I would perform the dance of the setting sun. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the dance of the wounded ox? <laughs> no. It is the dance of the setting sun. This is the dance of the wounded ox. <laughs> <laughs> I should have recognized the steps. Ra, forgive him. Do you not know contemporary dance? Go and speak to these manufacturers of false hoodedness. No, 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 that's not a good idea. We should, uh, we should stay home. <laughs> oh, fine. <laughs> then in that case, I shall regale you with excruciatingly dull stories of my 200 brothers and sisters. Oh, <laughs> did I ever tell you about Zosa the bug eater? <laughs> what about my sister, Maya? One tooth in her whole head. <laughs> At the harvest feast, she was the one in the corner sucking on a crocodile. All right, all right, we'll go. But it's not going to matter. They're not going to change their minds. Then they must be prepared to feel the wrath of... No. Do you think they'll be frightened? <laughs> Maybe after they stop laughing. This is all wrong. Don't tell me this is all wrong. I don't know why I let you talk me into this. No, 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 no. This is all wrong. Look at the hieroglyphics. They say this way to the bathing. <laughs> Look at the sarcophagus. Uh, it's cardboard. <laughs> you would not catch me dead in this. They're called props, now. Any decent Tomb Raider could break into this sarcophagus with a peacock feather. It just doesn't look good on camera. Such disrespect, look. Oh, this cannot pick jar is a sacred container. It holds the organs of a great pharaoh. Hey, Ryan, in heaven. What is it? A leg. Someone's leg? No, a chicken leg. <laughs> I'm famished. No. This is a bad idea. Let's get out of here before someone finds out who you are. Uh, not until I see with my eyes who will perform the part of me. <laughs> okay, Blake, the thing you gotta remember about this Nuff character is that he was hated by everyone, okay? He was, he was vile, he was evil, he was lazy. He was, he was, he was terrible. I know, I know, but... Who is he? <laughs> uh... I can tell you something of this Nuff fellow. Really? He was a prince of princes, beloved by all. <laughs> he would never utter such a phrase as, Ugh. <laughs> when he moved, it was with a grace that surpassed that of a wounded oxen. <laughs> that movie actor was Prince Nuff of Abu Simbel. So you think I should make the moan deeper? No. More of a scary. Just be scary. You shouldn't get too excited. Mother, what does it say right there? <sighs> the producers will be auditioning local talent to play significant parts in this motion picture. Significant parts? They're talking about me. The article is about me. Well, they don't mention you specifically, dear. Well, I can't decide what to wear. <laughs> Why don't you wear your pink blouse? Nobody wears pink anymore. Everyone knows last year's pink, this year's purple. Oh, why don't you wear purple then? Because everyone will be wearing purple. <laughs> I want to look like I'm saying, I don't need this part, but I might take it if you ask me nicely. 
<laughs> How about green? Oh, don't even talk to me about green. <laughs> well, sweetie, uh, to be honest, I don't actually see any characters in here that are right for you. Well, check around halfway through. That's when they usually introduce a character of a great beauty. <laughs> yeah, no, nothing like that. Come on, Mom, there's got to be some sort of Kath Rosita Jones meets Britney Spears part. Oh, well, there's the wife of the chubby goat seller. I don't think so. I don't do the goat thing. You have to go home. You have a task to perform. And that is what I'm doing right now. I'm being true to myself. I'm not about to let these people misrepresent the name of Nuff. <laughs> there. They're like him. I, I want you to move more like him. Uh, what about him? Well, he walks like a wounded auction. <laughs> no, that is not true. See, uh, watch and be amazed. <laughs> you, you're probably wondering who this is. This is my friend Na. My friend Bob. My friend Bob. My good friend Bob. 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 Could you come here? That is the stuff of nothing. <laughs> Wardrobe did a great job on your bandages. They, they're different from mine. I do my own bandages. Of course he does. I mean, why shouldn't he? It's not like he's a real mummy back from the dead. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> no, it's not. Um, he's just Bob. Who does his own bandages? I'll be in the corner. Who's the kid? I have no idea. It's really short. This is beyond crazy. Can you believe it? Believe what, dear? They say they're going to hire local talent, but there's no part in here for me. <laughs> but all they want is someone to play a, a haughty Tomb Raider, a good-looking older woman, a chubby goat seller, and his dumpy wife. <laughs> but I need to get in there and show them how good I look on camera. <laughs> Wait a minute. If you guys audition for the other parts, I can get in with you. Oh, or maybe I could be the good-looking older woman and your father could be the haughty Tomb Raider. <laughs> right. Or maybe we should just get you both a goat. <laughs> okay, Blake, remember. <laughs> Wounded oxen. <laughs> and? I can stand this no longer. That is preposterous! <laughs> Mummies don't go around saying, "ugh." <laughs> oh, look at me! I'm a mummy! <laughs> That's it. Blake, do him. <laughs> Good. Good. Oh, very nice. Oh, you can learn a lot from Bob, Blake. <laughs> nice. There you are. What are you up to now? Uh, they asked me to be a stand-in. Why are you helping them? You said yourself the script is all lies. But the directing man said I have talent. He, he likes my arg. <laughs> what is our stand-in doing now? I'm attempting to be truthful to the spirit of Prince Nuff. Uh -huh. Look, this is a pose at the Battle of the Hittites. <laughs> and this is a pose of him gesturing to rock. See? Ouch. And this is a pose of him at feasting time. Look, a big food. <laughs> okay. Can we shoot the scene now? Blake, you're in. Bob, you're out. Bob's a bit of an oddball, but his bandages are Classic, the broom. <laughs> I'm thinking, I might give him a line in the movie. Oh, you sure he's ready for that? Not too bad. Well, you know, with those bandages, you could be a star. I knew it. What's my line? <laughs> That's not my sarcophagus. I'm more angry. 
That is not my sarcophagus. Oh, yeah, but, but scared. Scared. That is not my sarcophagus. Brilliant. Brilliant. See you tomorrow. I have done it. <laughs> I've completed task 199. I have been true to myself. I do not believe that to be so. In fact, I question your complete understanding of the task, Nuff. But the man behind the camera said I could be a star. <laughs> if that is what you think, I am afraid you will never enter the Golden Palace. Oh, Royal Advisor, please give me a clue. Look inside yourself, Nuff. What? <laughs> that is an impossible taskmaster. I hope he told you to give up acting. But I have been true to myself all day, but he does not think that I can accomplish my task. Oh, listen to how well I do my line. That's not my sarcophagus. <laughs> Did you not believe my interpretation? No, and you were pointing to a real sarcophagus. Enough. You're not a good actor. You're a mummy. In fact, you're not even a good mummy. If you were a good mummy, you'd just lie there and turn to dust. Oh, I see. The royal protector is jealous of the Prince of Abu Simbel, huh? What? <laughs> oh, this is no surprise. Uh, tomorrow I will be in another golden palace known as Hollywood. <laughs> Is that where the canines live? It's Hollywood. <laughs> Hollywood. Wood! <laughs> That's not my circum. <laughs> That's not my circumphagus. <laughs> That's not my circum. <laughs> oh, look, it is. You look ridiculous. I am dressed the way modern pharaohs dress. You look like an overstuffed egg roll with glasses. Can I get a bottle of water, please? Thank you. Can I get a bottle of water, please? <laughs> Can I get a towel, please? Why not a hot towel? Why not? Can I get a hot towel, please? <laughs> <laughs> This is the kind of thing that attracts attention. Oh, I'm not afraid of the spotlight royal protector. That was the downfall of Snefru the scribe. He was always very timid when it came to a front of the crowd. What you know about ancient Egypt is astounding, Bob. That's because Bob is a method actor. <laughs> now, I still can't get over how good your bandages look. They're so tight, don't they cut off your circulation? It is of luck that I have no circulatory system. <laughs> It's a method thing. Do you not think that James should be in the movie, Jules? Oh, that's a great idea. Well, you are about the right size to play the mummy's sidekick, so... Who was that? Oh, but, 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 but. Not so fast. Local auditions for Invaders of the Forgotten Tomb, number 39. Oh, hi. We're here to audition. I also brought you some brownies. I made them myself. They were left over from the parent-teacher conference. Would you please just do the line? <laughs> ah! This must be the place where the evil Prince Nuff lives. Thank you. Next! Hey, leave the brownies. <laughs> I'm confident by being in this movie, I will accomplish my task. <laughs> You're supposed to be true to yourself. Look at you. You're as phony as these movie people are. That is not true. Tal? <laughs> All you care about is yourself. Also not true. Uh, water? <laughs> what? I have a thirst. <laughs> I'm disappointed in you now. Okay, people, please, let's get ready to make some movie magic. Sidekick, Bab, I need you in your spot. I will show these people what being true to myself really is. Here, watch. And... Action! It's not my sarcophagus. It's not my sarcophagus. 
Yes, I will not say that line. Okay. Instead, I wish to say that this movie is full of falsehoods. Prince Naf of Abu Simbel was a good ruler, one who granted slaves a water break even when none was scheduled. <laughs> he was a kind ruler, one who accepted presents no matter how big they were. <laughs> he was a ruler with a heart as large as the Sphinx, but with a proper sized nose, not one that fell off. <laughs> Anything else? Oh, yes, one more thing. <clears throat> That's not my sarcophagus! <laughs> Cut. <laughs> and... Someone get me casting! <laughs> Local auditions for Invaders of the Forgotten Tomb, number 57. Uh, I, I thought I was the, uh, the haughty Tomb Raider. <laughs> <laughs> this is just what we've been waiting for. The tomb of the most hated pharaoh in the history of time. Prince Nuff. <laughs> Next. Was that, that it? Next. Wait a minute, you know, I, 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 you can't just blow me off like some kind of chump. That kind of thing really makes me angry. I mean, Do you think you have accomplished task 199? Yes. No. I am not so sure. I have been watching you from the Golden Palace. The royal protector was correct. You have been acting the part of the spoiled prince. Spoiled? I was not spoiled. I asked for 23 towels, and I used them all. You did not listen to anyone. Sorry? You have been selfish, self-adoring, constantly seeking attention. You're correct, Master Set. I must admit, Nuff, I was hoping you would succeed at this task. But I fear you have failed again. Well then, let us see. <laughs> it's not the way it's supposed to be. I was true to myself all along. Uh, I guess being a spoiled, selfish prince is your true self. <laughs> yes, thank you for showing that to me, Master Set. Ah, oh, help me. Can we apply it, please? Thank you. Hey. To sidekick and new mummy. <laughs> and action. That's not my sarcophagus. Cut! Brilliant! That was you are a natural. Now that that is my nuff. Huh? There is only one prince nuff of Abu Simbel. Soul! <laughs> 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 <laughs>